Hello, welcome to the latest episode of Micro Bits and Bobs. Um, I'm here today with Grace, and we're going to be looking at um, the Micro Bit Christmas tree from Pocket Money Electronics. Uh, Andrew Gale has very kindly been sending me these uh, demonstration versions. So the original version had um, the Micro Bit. Uh, I've forgotten what I'm going to say, Grace. Oh dear. The original one had the um, NeoPixels on. And then we update it and it's got near pixels with a, a speaker and he's just started his Kickstarter project and he sent me a couple of samples. I've got the Raspberry Pi version, which I'll put to one side for a moment because I don't have a Raspberry Pi here. And I've got the Kickstarter uh, micro version. So we'll take the pack, pack, we'll have a look what it's got. So it comes with some nice detailed instructions on how to set it up and how to solve it together. Now what's different about this version on the Kickstarter project is it's a solder at home version so the NeoPixels uses um, sub-miniature device type LEDs so you're not going to be soldering those yourself very easily so he's produced one with a board and then some resistors and some very small programmable LEDs alongside a nice piezo speaker now, be warned, the Piezo speakers is a, just a simple uh, buzzer, so it will sound very much like your standard Christmas cards. Um, you're not going to be playing music out of this, not a hi-fi system, but we should be able to put it together so that we can have the lights flashing and the music going on at the same time. So our first little job here is going to be to solve this together. Are we ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we'll come back in a minute when we've done that. Yeah, okay, we're back. Um, the solving job was, uh, was, was fairly straightforward, I'm not sure how where you can see that but um, I'm not the best solder in the world but it was fairly straightforward no major problems so best bet now is to uh, is plug it into our computer and see if it works okay so we're back um, I've got it all wired up what I have to say I really like is the fact that you can put the crocodile clips at the back and you can stand it up on its own I've got mine held up with a little bit of tape at the moment just so it doesn't fall over for the camera um, Andrew supplied it with some instructions and on the back there's some code for um, the MicroPython, for the PXT or Code the Academy as they like to call it, Code the Microbit as they like to call it now, and something for the, for the code bug as well. On the Microbits of Bob's website we've got a couple of projects for you. Um, the first one that you might want to look at um, is done in PXT or Code the, Mi code the Microbit. Um, the idea of this one is you've got a background process running here that plays jingle bells and we've got a foreground progress pro process or another process running at the same time that's flashing the lights. So that's a, a nice simple uh, demonstration of that one. We've also got um, a project uh, down here um, where this is a, a Python project. I've got it set up in the, in the mood at the moment where we've got uh, jingle bells playing as before we've got the uh, Merry Christmas being run at the same time so that's displaying on the screen and we've also got um, the Christmas lights flashing uh, as they go along all, all going at the same time so let's plug it in and see how it goes so I've got it all wired up plug in the micro bit and we can see you can see that We've got the display running, should say Merry Christmas. We've got the lights flashing and we can hear the, uh, the buzzer playing away in the background, nice and irritating. So thank you very much for watching. All these projects and some new worksheets will be coming along on the Microbits and Bob's website. I really recommend that you, um, you look up the Kickstarter projects, I'll put that in the description. This is uh, Andrew Gale from Pocket Money Electronics, um, great little idea, great little project, I think it's only about four or five pound, buy one, have fun.